Nine minutes after four o'clock, you're listening to the catalog of the legendary Half Pint and my very special guest right here in studio. Big ups to you, C as well. Of course, European reggae artist and also an artist with a song, a collaboration with the legend Half Pint in Big my studio yourself. today. Big ups to you, C, and the entire Europe crew and all Europeans, any race, class, or creed from Mr. Reggae, from Mr. Jamaica, on <laughs> top of many one and people. Half Pint. <laughs> Listening to your catalog door. See? Or you feel when you hear yourself. You know what I mean? What goes through your mind? What goes through your mind? Each topic, we just pray that each one and one out there who will listen, listen with an open mind and even learn our grasp from it because no, uh, nobody wants to be a loser or feeling the pain or the stress economically, socially, or I mean, you know what I mean? Yes. Personal between a man and a woman. Yes. So each one can pick up from it. I sing songs in a sense that coming from the art, yes. so that it can relate to other people who feel it and knowing it, can detect it and realize, hey. Somebody has to go through it too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. Up still, it's not done. True, true. <laughs> it's not over till yeah. it's over. Right. Now, Half Pint, you were born on November 11, mm. 1961. Oh, right. uh, so you've been around for quite some time. Mm. Talk mm. to me about some of the life lessons that you've learned or the most valuable lessons that you have learned in life that has taken you through your journey that you can share with us today. Uh, it's not much of a use, but I still can answer some because. I've been living it all this time. And yeah. growing, growing up in Kingston, Jamaica here, I've experienced Jamaica changes from like the 60s, the 70s, the 80s. That's saw the changes. And I can remember them or I speak of them. Some people may not even like here in Jamaica. Mm. It's the truth. Yes. And in reality, what a society project, even from a youthful stage, it take, takes root and grow and become. And now, as they would say, it's now taking its toll. It's all that we, as a people here in Jamaica, we know known as Jamaican. I know I hear the terms Jamaica brand. Mm -hmm. Am I just a brand? Mm -hmm. Is that my status come down to? Why the respect and the whole social order so low and economically? Mm -hmm. And who am I? Is it that I'm not really getting or is it should that I should be taking? Yes. Because in reality, from the peace, the treaty with the Maroons and the British, from them time, we're supposed to become a sovereign nation. Which well, there's a thing with you people have mentioned quite a few times about reparation. Mm -hmm. There's a grant yes. which is established by the United Nations for all countries that was overtaken by any other nation. Mm -hmm. That within a hundred years it should be returned to the sovereign indigenous people. people. Yes. yes. And all of that, if it should return to us all now, to these loans of my year come across Jamaica from IMF mm -hmm. to personal independent people, all these years. A little island which consists of not even say five million people, mm -hmm. we still can work out our sort of yes. what kind of conspiracy, what kind of lie, what kind of denial, or what kind of dupe we were still living under economically and religiously. Yes. The consciousness and the spirituality, then damn and that from where I seduce me. And the economical part, <laughs> where did the money go? Yes. And I tell me this and I tell me that everybody come and cry, cry, cry. No cry shouldn't be there. And I'll be a lie. Mm -hmm. And all this is how me grow and I come to, even though I'm living in Jamaica. These are the things that I come across. And it's not proper or nice or sounding like, but in reality, we need to do better and we can do better. Mm -hmm. We we'll start respecting people. Then. We see it we're in that so many of our young youths have died for the last even three decades, which I be with this half. It never had to be so called creatives, from creative suffering mm -hmm. to collective genocide. Yes. What are some of the works that what are some of the other things that you're working on right now? Yeah, I've got songs which come in all along going to be appealing to situation and still going to be giving kind of encouragement or look out for themselves so that they can know so that the future still is yours. Yes. Or ours and better must come. Yes. Kind of opportunity and the ability and the win. If I know one generation and next generation win. I do believe that they say one generation must sacrifice for the next generation. But all who may leave now are they think that are them so battered down, them don't know if they're not come or go. Mm -hmm. So be. But we know better. Must come. Natural. You see, what what can we expect from you? Uh, uh this collaboration with Half Pint. What else are you working on right now? I'm working at the moment um at a mixtape. Mm -hmm. It will be um most of my tunes, um remixed on classic rhythms. Mm -hmm. Studio on Penthouse, even like even like uh, 
NATO rhythms. Yes. Um, uh, it will come out at the end of February. We'll call, uh, the, the title will be In the Mood. Okay. And it's about Lovers Rock and, uh, and Rock Steady. Yeah. Exactly. yeah. And, so, and so you're going to be releasing that in Germany? Yeah, in Germany and in Jamaica for sure. Okay, good. Well. Yeah. All right. Yeah, and, and any other collaborations that we can look for uh, forward to from you? Any other yeah, for sure. Jamaican artists that you want to work with? Yeah, for sure. I, I'm. Um, I will. I will work next week on a collaboration with Stranger Cole. Nice. Yeah. So uh, we're looking forward for that, and I think there will be other artists as well who I'm working with. So let's see what happens. The reggae music and the power therein. Half pint. What would you like to say in closing to your fans who have supported your music? Music, who have supported you over the years, and you know all the ladies them who <laughs> love our pint mm. and all of the Monday with us rate our pint. Thank you, <laughs> <laughs> thank you, my darling. Yeah, man. Let's <laughs> yeah, set the stage down together, because in reality, Jamaica, I must tell you all that I give thanks, and I'm still feeling strong and proud about you all. No matter where we go anywhere in the world, we represent, and well, I'm out there, I represent you all with the maximum. So, so. To all the sports athletes, all the dance hall crew, the man who even put up the box, mm -hmm. maximum respect here, sir. The work still goes on. The journey of life still goes on. On and, and on and on. Mm -hmm. Thank you so very much, Half Pint. It's always great talking to you. Al Kibble on because of yourself. And of course, you see, nice to, of course, have you in studio you. as well. A wonderful collaboration. And I wish you all the success on the uh, song and on your album as well. And of course, for all your future ventures. But Half Pint, of course, you know, on a Thursday, hey. I've been dropping mm. some Half Pint, boy. Sure, yeah, yeah. 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 Of course, yeah. most yeah. definitely. Yeah. Yes, yeah. yes. Yeah. No. I, I love the old school vibe, you know what I mean? Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. it's just nice and good and, you know, when you can't up yeah, upon, you know, just right. feel good, that yeah, yeah. feel good something there. Yes. Yes. Yeah, exactly. and we talk about the passion again. Yes. And so, it is very present uh, in this kind of music uh, on a Pepper Seed Thursday. Half fine. Thank you so very much. Thanks, All yeah. the best. And, of course, you know, for being a living legend and, you know, just for a contribution to music, uh, that which you have done and that which you continue to do. And I just want to say blessings, guidance, and continued success. See him, see him, Miss Kitty, give thanks and I'll say mostly that I'm glad you came along at the right time because I say when I hear your personality somewhat on the radio, yes. I know so I'll have enough that dull. Thank you. Bright and right. Thank you, baby. Love you, lads. Thank you so very much. Uh, 17 minutes after 4 o'clock, still Nationwide 90 FM with your fluffy diva and DJ Juju Royal Half Pint. You see, right here with me on a Pepper Seed Thursday, taking you down memory lane back in the good old days and rekindling those nostalgic memories. Yes.